Do you know the other day, about a week or so ago, we talked about how the Doctor Strange 2 trailer leaked online. And of course, it was added on to the end of Spider-Man No Way Home. And we talked about it a little bit, but we didn't talk about it in detail because a lot of people hadn't seen it yet. And that's fine, even though it was just a trailer. But one of the things I said in trying to not give away any details about the Doctor Strange 2 trailer was, you know, there are a lot of things, 95% of the time when I think something's never going to happen, it doesn't happen. Sometimes I have my mind changed before it happens because you guys make great arguments or I see more evidence or whatever. But then there are some times where I absolutely do not think there's any way something's going to happen, but it does anyway, and I'm shocked. And I said, there is something that happens in the Doctor Strange 2 trailer that I never thought they would do. <laughs> like, I didn't think in a million years they would do. And they did it. And now that the Doctor Strange 2 trailer is now out and public, we can talk about, we can talk Let's about that. Let's get into this. And I'll, I'll, I won't bury the lead. <laughs> I cannot, I am shocked, shocked, I tell you that they brought in the what if dark Doctor Strange. Now, I now, let me say, I, I know there is a possibility that's not the what if Doctor Strange. I, I understand there's a possibility that this is a different thing. I get it. But what they seem to be implying here is that this is the what if Doctor Strange. And bringing a what if animated character into it is not something I thought they would, uh, straight up, I'll just call it. I, I, I thought there's no way, no way, said I. <laughs> and then I'm watching this trailer and it's like, well, there goes that because there he is. And I thought that was actually quite exciting the way they did it. Listen, I think this trailer overall was dynamite. I thought it was a dynamite trailer. It, I mean, it does the little things like, hey, get excited. Here's Doc Strange, you know, get excited. Uh, here's, let me see if I can find her in this. Maybe I can, maybe I can't. Yeah, here's Wanda. Yeah. Right? Yes. So every, everybody's excited when Wanda comes up. I love the fact that they even reference the event. They reference the events of Westfield, but the audience clearly didn't need to know what's happened in Westfield, right? So that's classic Kevin Feige what, right there. Uh, you know, everything, seeing a lot of weird stuff, seeing, I love seeing Wong. Wong is Wong becoming- Wong is just the best. He is becoming, honestly, one of my favorite characters in the MCU. Every time he talks, it's entertaining. Whether he's in Shang-Chi or whether it's in Doctor Strange or whether it's an Avengers movie or whatever. The dude is just awesome. He's becoming more and more pivotal, it seems like, to the universe. So it didn't really give us, as a lot of first trailers don't anymore, it didn't really give us what's the story about. It just gave us a feel. The first trailer just gave us a feel. Here's some of the things you can look forward to. I expect the second trailer will give us a more definitive, okay, here's what this is about. But probably the most exciting thing to me was the return of Chiwetel Ejiofor. Uh, seeing Cal oh, Mordo no. back... It, it's just, that's the way, that's what should be done. I'm trying to see if I can find a still of him in here. I'm going to have a very hard time finding it. I probably won't be able to find it. But anyway, we knew he was coming back, but it excites me to see him back, you know? And uh, that is great. So I thought the trailer looked really wonderful. Ray, you had a chance to check out the trailer. Did you not? Yeah. What did you think about the trailer? How did you oh, like it? I just was in awe for all the Wanda scenes, especially when right. she's in her uniform. I think she's going to cause a lot of uh, havoc in this film not only just uh dr strange but i think she's gonna have a big deal in this this movie that's all i get from it just because they they still haven't she still hasn't unleashed her fury on the marvel cinematic universe no we still haven't really that seen her unleash way. her full power her so full I, I can't wait to see her hopefully she has uh, a bigger role than just what we see like just being like a oh yeah come to me for like some guidance or something like that i don't know what what her uh smaller role would be but I hope she gets uh she gets busy in this movie. <laughs> Kim, what about you? Oh, this looks exciting. This looks really, really exciting. Wanda looks great. I like what's going on. It looks like either in another universe or he's at Christine's wedding or is he marrying Christine finally? I don't know. Um, I love Mordo. Let his hair grow out oh, a little Mordo. bit. He yep. is ready. He's ready to get it. I think this is going to be uh I think the trailer was tame in compared to what we're gonna get yeah because i get that remember sense. they said this will kind of be the first mcu movie to be along the lines of a horror film oh yeah so well, they kind of said the same thing about the first doctor strange movie well uh, man doctor strange. it was pretty it was pretty it, <laughs> it you was, had a very traditional I, horror director doing it yeah and you know they kind of that they kind of said that this is going to kind of be a bit of a horror now then but there's more craziness in this one yeah i don't know that craziness 
necessarily you're, you're, equals you're, horror, Did you but... see him fighting um, when it looked like the uh, what if version? Because I was yeah. thinking, where are the tentacles? It's very quick, but if you see, he goes like this, and there's these. I don't know if they're tentacles or oh, monsters. Oh, you can see the creature or... too. There's a quick shot where you can actually see. Yeah, it. yeah and yeah. I was like, oh, we're going there. Yeah. I think I think this is tame. I think the next trailer is really going to make us excited. And I, I, I don't know what it, what are your thoughts, but I think somewhere along the line in this, she's going to be helping him. And yes, I'm focused. I'm helping you. And she's going to hear that echoing, mom, mom, where are you? And she might go a little berserk. Yeah. I listen. I thought in. Um, WandaVision. Mm -hmm. When WandaVision ended, I thought Wanda is going to be the antagonist of Doctor Strange mm -hmm. and the Multiverse of Madness. Mm -hmm. And I think she still might be. Like, I, like, look, obviously they're implying something different now. They're implying she's going to work alongside of him and all that kind of stuff. But I still think there is a possibility here. She ends up being a problem that strange needs to deal with. I agree. I I, I think agree. I and I and I'm going to be damn excited if they do there because oh, I want to see Wanda oh, throw. Damn. I want to see her go crazy because she yeah. could kill everyone in the MCU. Because she she's been to. studying, she's been reading the books, finding out who am I, what is this Scarlet Witch thing that I have, what is this power that I have, so she can harness it. But what I I want to say is that as a trailer, I love that they didn't give everything away. Thank goodness yeah i well, didn't I mean, feel i, I didn't more. feel like that I, gave... I still need them to tell us what the story is like that a trailer I'm fine needs with what to I do thought. that and I, so i think this for a first trailer this is perfectly good mm -hmm. i think the second trailer which has been kind of the the pattern lately the mm -hmm. second trailer then becomes the one that says okay here's what this story is about and i think we're going to get that a little bit later on the so. chat is pointing out like i don't know if it's the what if dr strange is it strange supreme I, a lot of people are saying that is that what we refer to this other doctor strange i don't know if they, they attach that to him in the uh uh in the thing or if that's a comic reference but i just think when you look at him i mean he's, he's definitely looks and sounds like the what if version right but can, so but can you imagine a duel between wanda and doctor strange oh, it'd be awesome just a fight oh that awesome. would be insane like crazy Crazy, crazy. It would be Inception times 10. Yeah, we would need edibles and everything just to, <laughs> just to be oh my at that, in that dimension. <laughs> no, honestly, like Doctor Strange 1, the first Doctor Strange, the whole time I was thinking, man, I should have took a puff or something. <laughs> Look, when I said I'd make cookies for the next movie, that is not what I was talking about. <laughs> anyway, guys, the question is for you. Did you have a chance to check out the Doctor Strange 2 trailer? If so, what did you think about it? Whatever it is you guys thought, jump down to the comment section below and leave your thoughts there.